Nutrient tissue, nutrient tissue. Yeah, I saw that and I was like, huh. I didn't think that would be a thing, but I was wrong. Happily. Nothing. Nothing at all. Oh my god, this place is crawling with these guys. Did that, did that robot activate? I need to go check, actually. Yeah, you got it, all right. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Oh, uh, bulletproof glass, of course. Why wouldn't it be bulletproof? Okay, well, he killed him somehow. I'm not going to question it. Uh, let's see your toxin. See, guys, this is what it's all about. Making the AI do all the work while you have all the fun. Pharmaceutical lab? Okay. See, the trick is... You get the best companions. Oh shit, that's actually not good. Uh, let's do this real quick. Not a problem anymore, see? That shoots pretty straight. What the fuck? I don't know how I did that, but I did. Don't ask me how, I just did it. Yeah, I think it's just a weapon. I think it was like Sky UI or something for Skyrim that would show you a picture of the item you're about to pick up. Or was it regular Skyrim that did that? It'd be like, hey, this is this. Okay, we're not going out there. Did you guys destroy my robot? If you did, I'm going to be... They did, you sons of bitches. He was just a child. He'd only been alive for a few hours or maybe minutes, if that. Uh, let's see here. Oh, hold on. I need to check out them blue-collar off-work duds. To make a... Uh... Yeah, I did not mean to jump. I did not mean to jump. Okay. Should get behind that. That looks pretty nice. Uh, okay. Close to where we need to go. I'm just kind of making sure. I'm trying to pick up as much stuff as I can, but at the same time be picky about what I pick up. Uh, okay, so I'm still in combat with like that asshole. <laughs> oh shit, I'm, I'm almost out of ammo in this thing. I've been using it too much. Another artifact right off the bat. We're about to complete the ring right away, aren't we? Artifact Zeta. Same vision of Delta Halo. Are we ever going to find, um, are we ever going to find Artifact Ligma? Because I'm really interested to see where we find Artifact Ligma at. Probably in the ball system. That would make sense, right? Ooh, that's a fast fire rate on that motherfucker, huh? It's really fast. Okay, let's see if there's anything good back here. I guess we upgrade lock picking here on in until like we really get something. Like so, like I understand it's the beginning of the game, but man, the beginning of most games below because you're so underpowered and you can't do shit. It's like Dark Souls, you know. Or the Soulsborne games, you can't really function until like a good chunk through. Yeah, I don't under. Where he active modify coachman? Okay. Epic shotgun. Hold on. Let me see what kind of weapon we got equipped. Uh. Okay, we have a regular shotgun or a rare shotgun rather. Radioactive modified coachman. Okay, well, we're going to favorite that really quick and there we go. Because it's a purple. 
So obviously it's better than the blue. Okay, novice, so pick this lock. Uh, nope. Nope. Uh, nope. Okay, so obviously it belongs to the other ring right there. So where does this belong? Probably... Okay, well, let's see. Let's look at it this way. Yeah, but those are occupying... Hmm, does this make sense? And, okay, that's the only logical way that could go. That do Okay, that doesn't work, so maybe... Um... Yeah, none of these combos are really working. I just haven't found... Like, that works. That does not work. That does not work. That does not work. That doesn't work. That doesn't work. That doesn't work. Let's see. Let's check on the inner ring. Nope. 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 Yes. Okay, so that's guaranteed to fit there. Okay, so, and then that's already set because that's the only ones available. Are they different distances? They are different distances apart. Slightly by one. By one they are. Okay, that works though. Got him. Okay, I need to pick two more locks or three more locks rather. And that'll be leveled up. Uh, sure, synth me and ham, why not? Oh, uh, let's see here, going through here. Like, I'm not gonna lie, like, these, like, the textures and everything in this game look good. Like, it's a pretty high bar, in my opinion. Like, I'm sure we're gonna run into some shit that looks like garbage. Like, some of these areas and some of the way the, uh... Here's somebody moving. Or not. Um... Yeah. I keep pressing Y. Why do I keep pressing Y? Like, why is the jump? What other game have I played where why is the action button? I don't think there is one. That's the thing. Oh, shit. No, you don't have to shoot at me, Terry. We're done. We're done here. Hunting cage brain. Okay. Come here, bitch. Yeah, that was me shooting. Oh, shit. Um. Oh, my God. This thing carries four rounds at a time. Are you serious? Hell yes. Oops. Wanted to reload. Nothing else. Hell yeah. Okay. Can I please go through? Okay. All right. Not doing too bad. Ooh, what was that? Okay. Another cage brain. Okay. Yeah, the textures in the game are definitely top. They're they're definitely top notch. Um, I have a I had a friend ask me, you know, like just conversation. He's like, "Hey man, do you think Starfield's Game of the Year contender?" And I said, "Yeah, it's a contender, but is it going to win? Not by a long shot. I don't think because like people were people were missing Baldur's Gate type RPGs, and I think the reason Baldur's Gate three is going to win." is simply because it gave player it gave players what they wanted for a long time and that's really the gist of it is like hey it's brought something to the table that has not been brought in like almost 10 plus years i think i can't think of anything close to it besides Baldur's gate 2 and like maybe divinity original sin you know um i really think that's what Add the artifacts. Okay. Uh, return to the lodge. Return to the lodge. Okay. Yeah, well, we're about to knock out three missions at once, y'all. I wonder if this, like, if this cross saves with my console. Like, if I wanted to. Ah, shit.
Like if um, I wanted to download this to the console and sit back on the couch and play off stream, if I could do that. Because like, man, like if, like really the, like if the fact that there's only one viewport, that really is killing it for me for the ship customization. Like it truly is, like that matters so much. It really does, just to be able to hop out of your ship and like not be fucking cramped. But you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see. I see what you did there, Walter. And I know you've been secretly crying into your piles of money <laughs> waiting for <laughs> Actually, I am at your service, Captain. Basco, shut up. The adults are talking. Don't stop. Wait. Is that? <laughs> and to think the first artifact was taking up dust on the library show. Now, look at them all. Yep. You feel it a bit, can't you? Ever since I found the second Why? one, was the vision, being around them is oh just God. comforting. So hey, I, I'm still not a hundred percent, plus I feel guilty dragging you into all of this. Why don't I stick around and help you get a chip? Okay, that's fine. Traveling together sounds good to me. Air is available to your crew now, sweet. Okay, he's now my active companion. Just, what are we building here? I haven't picked up any kind of frequency or signal coming from it. That doesn't mean much. This thing could be emitting something we can't even detect. As far as we know, we could be building a gigantic bomb that will blow up as soon as we finish it. Or maybe it's some kind of interstellar. No, never mind. Service. Why would either of those things give the discoverer visions and music? It's a message. I'm sure of it. We just have to hope that finding more of the pieces will give us some clue. I hear that. Moving forward sometimes means fumbling around in the dark. I think Cora and I can use some downtime. Ooh. Might you let me know if you ever want to team up again. Look at all them skills. Oh, and since it tends to come up, me and my Rugrat co-pilot work as a team. That's non-negotiable. If I'm coming with, that means Cora is on your ship. Okay, you can stay here then. Hmm. Why not? What do you think, Cora? It's really nice to have more company. New stories, new data. What? Data? <laughs> All right. We're in. Let's see what the galaxy throws at us next. All right. Modified calibrator rattler added. Level up to what? Level 10? Okay, let me level up. Yeah, that was the Xbox achievement thing you heard. Comrade Guard, guard 2. Um, oh, okay. Uh, do we want to level anything up here? Yeah. Nah, not that one, I don't think. I think maybe we upgrade Persuasion a little bit more. Probably, because we're running into a lot of pers like persuasion checks. What about the money one? Can we do the money one? Uh. Oh no, I thought that was a hold. Whatever, whatever. It's done now. There's nothing we can do. I know everyone's excited by the artifacts, but we need to be- Look at you two. I'm jealous. Possible. I tried following up on some leads myself, but- came back empty-handed of course she did they could be anywhere can't they yeah embedded in a rock or in the hands of an unsuspecting novelty goods trader okay these artifacts really are something else aren't they mateo i catch myself just staring at the collection sometimes wondering what it all means Maybe that's how our ancestors felt when they were looking up at the stars for the first time. They didn't just gawk at the stars, Mateo. They explored. They tested. Science brought us to space, not daydreaming. I disagree. What's the point of science if not to enable humanity's dreams? And where do those dreams come from? Not every dream is a pleasant one. I agree with Noel. The work is what moves us forward. 
You're with me, right? Science or dreams? Which one is the true muse of space exploration? Uh, well, both, but you know, I'm not taking sides between you two. Neutrality in a debate? I guess your side forfeits. Uh, how can you forfeit if you don't even take a side? You're getting rusty with your comebacks, Mateo. That's oh shit. Play. She just, said your clapback game is bad. You know what? I just realized I completely overtook this whole conversation. Take that funny hat off. About you and Andresia celebrating a win for the group. Andreja, Andreja. I do not mind being asked to join in a debate. It was good to hear everyone's sides. But I do agree that we accomplished something together. I never said that. Thank you for your help. Uh, and for yours, I'd be happy to keep traveling I with have you. No objections. Let us see what else we can find out there. Noel, Ruh -roh. pulling some interesting data from those new artifacts. I think artifacts. we're good. I think we're good. Tell the rock to meet me back on board the station. Roger that, Vladimir. Maybe? He's on I think we're way. good. Okay, so we added three artifacts to the thing. Oh no, this is going to have like two or three halos. Sorry, I bumped the mic there. Okay, yeah, OBS went all black on me again. Yeah, it went all black on me. I don't understand why. Like, then it kicked back on. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I think it's this game. It's probably pulling a lot of resources. It's definitely odd. Okay, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Nothing bad's happening. Not yet, at least. Um... I mean, I really want... We, we were on that the so the issue is is like not much of any ship i wish like i could take a ship here's what we'll do we'll go to a random planet I, like i know i said we were going to do some main story mission stuff but what we're going to do is we're going to go to a random planet and we're going to jack the next ship or if we're out in space we're going to jack ship and we're going to modify the fuck out of it okay so what is the current quest however Talk to Vladimir. Is that course? Yeah, he's there. So let's um, let's actually go find what is this the that symbol? What are these symbols? I guess Free Star Collective versus other factions. I guess maybe maybe let's go to one of these random planets. Just or one of these random systems just to see if we can get another ship. What the fuck? Who are you? Actually, you know what? I don't have to get a random ship. What am I thinking? What am, what's wrong with me? I can just... Here we go. We got this ship, which I thought I liked. I'm fucking up, guys. I'm sorry. We are going to go back to... Here, we'll probably just do this first. I mean, it makes sense. We'll do this first. We'll get what we need to do. And then what we'll do is uh, decommission that green ship, like completely de decommission it. And then um, I guess customize it a little bit just to at least try it. I don't, uh, I don't have any contraband on me, you crackheads. Oh, yeah, what do you know? I don't have anything on me yet. Uh, let's see, back up. I guess we go to the eye. Yep, travel to the eye. Okay, these are like micro cutscenes. I'm not gonna lie, they're kind of getting. They're kind of getting old. I can imagine what it'd be like playing on console right now, though. Like, it's got to be, like, atrocious to play on console. Oh, let's not make a mistake like last time. Slow down. Uh -huh. the eyes always open to constellation. Yeah, let's dock really quick. Like, I understand, like, Bethesda's, like, scope of practice with this game. But, man, I wish they put aliens in this game. Like, 
even a hostile force, like maybe one or two different hostile forces would have been nice, but no, we got fucking cults. Hey, this is what I want. Look at this. Look at this. This is so nice looking. You can see my ship docked, even though it's kind of like a weird docking situation, but man. This is what I want. I want to be able to like have my ship and not, well, okay. Uh, Y'all need to fix that real quick. But this is what I want. I want to be able to like, what was that? I played a game on PlayStation. You could kind of do that. You can kind of see how your ship was made and you can look out the windows of your spaceship. It was more like a station than anything. What the fuck was it called? It was so good. If you can get it for free, because like once you beat it once, it was like a roguelike too, the way it was like structured. What was that game called? It was in space. You would send ships down to go mine resources. It, they would fly back up. They would come back with like aliens sometimes. And you could go down there with them too. But like it was kind of boring if you did. Oh my God, I'm going to be, let me think. Either way, point still stands. Point still stands. You could like you could look out like it had these huge like habitation places, and then you could see outside the uh, you could see outside the uh, ship and into other parts like this. Like this is so neat to me. It really is. Genesis Alpha One. That's it. Genesis Alpha One. It's not a great game. That's why I said get it for free if it's on, if it's on like. PlayStation Plus or Xbox Game Pass. It's you don't that's not a game you pay money for. It really isn't. Sorry developers if you're watching this. It's not that great of a game. Um It's really not. But it, like it has some cool concepts in there that are kind of, they're, they 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 are fun. The whole the whole bug management thing. Your ship can become infested with bugs and like it'll just get destroyed no other questions asked like by like i mean infested you have to go underneath the ship like in the like crawl spaces to deal with some of the problems now that those artifacts aren't just blips of hope in the black sea i found an interesting pattern the grav anomaly generated by one of those artifacts it matches one on another planet a bigger one Oh boy, now we're talking All point right. me at him. Let me transfer over the data, but I need you wearing caution boots for this one. No telling what this thing is or why it's so large. Going to send you the mark close as I can, but I'm having trouble pinpointing the source. You'll need to explore the area on foot. Put your scanner to work. Don't know what you'll find. Keep your eyes open. Uh, land near the anomaly, use my scanner, got there, it. Maybe you catch a smile and uncover the source of it all. All right, go to Procyon 3. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to fast travel to Jemison. We're going to fast travel to a starport or something. Uh, I guess Mass District, I guess is where we want to go. Wherever we can land and change out the ship. Stroud Eklund has quickly become a major new ship manufacturer thanks to a huge influx of startup capital. Okay, whatever that means. Words are too big for me. So and concepts too. Oh shit! This in one place. I, still uh, feel I don't think this is where I wanted to be. Let's fast travel to. I guess uh, civilian or nothing. The, not there. I guess to New Atlantis. Pristine New Atlantis and the industrial powerhouse Sidonia are two of the largest cities in the United Colonies. Okay. Okay, sweet. So on this note, we're going to take a quick break. I will be right back.